welcome back i'm going to share an exercise not really an exercise this can be used like a martial arts punishment because these are one of those drills one of those exercises which are not necessarily very good for your health and you are supposed to do this every day 50 times these are not one of those these are exercises that are not risky not bad but not to be done too much this is more like a challenge this is more like something that you can punish your juniors or your younger siblings with so this is used like a punishment like for example in martial arts stand on your knuckles for 10 15 minutes it's not very healthy it's not going to give you some benefit physically but it will make you tough it will make you tough over here over here and over here so challenging exercises these are important not necessarily because they are very scientific they will work on your skills in some way but they will make you tough they will challenge you they will challenge your strength how strong you are how can you balance how strong your core is and how much you can take so this is one of those exercises i'll first show the exercise and then i'll also explain it. So there are two variations of this exercise, the easy one and the hard one. Easy one is in a sitting posture like this. You're going to take one of your leg, that is your right leg or your left leg. You're going to take it, extend the leg, place it on the floor, on your heel like this. So like this and then like this. Why this is difficult is because when you lift up one leg, you're going to go off balance. You have to balance while your leg is extended and you have to manage that and then you have to come back in the position because this position is not very good for balancing so you have to just touch and come back so all that takes calculation takes understanding of your own body weight which is why this is very important in those terms in terms of how do you understand balance so let us see what we are doing very simply from a sitting posture i am going to take my uh, right or left leg extend the leg place it forward on the floor it's going to look somewhat like this. You can place your hands in front for balance. Place it forward 45 degrees or maybe outside. This is what will be easy. Not outside, not straight. Kind of like 45 degrees. In the corner, place your hands forward. Place it and bring back. Extend your leg and bring back. One and back. Two and back. You have to manage the balance and weight. One and back. And two and back. And this way you can try this 10 times, 20 times and it should be something very challenging. For exercise number 2 that is you are lifting your leg, extending your leg but placing it in air and then coming back. Touching your own hand and coming back. This will require some more balance, some more understanding of your body weight and there is no shortcut. You will have to practice exercise number 1 to get to exercise number 2. But I will just walk through the steps one by one. It is something very simple. Uh, not really simple but it's simple to understand it's hard to execute execution will take time it will take practice place your hands forward for balance basically what we are doing is lift up one leg hit your hand it is going to look somewhat like this but the problem is this thing is not going to be there so you have to balance 
so you can use some little flow in your movement you can do a little hopping and uh, time your what time you are going to do this you can time it in your mind and yes one and two and three and four and five how am i doing this a little practice of the first exercise if you get exercise number 1 properly and if you are not lifting too much and if you are maintaining the upper body in this alignment that is my upper body is not going forward it's not going back it's staying in this line which is why i am able to do this and come back but if my upper body goes back i'll most probably fall so that's all for today if you like this video hit the like button subscribe and press the bell icon also what you can see on the screen and what i was wearing in this video if you like what i was wearing kalari dhoti 100% cotton very much suitable for all the martial arts yoga and all these cool stuff it is available online if you want to order this online the link will be in description you can approach a whatsapp number you can leave a message and we'll get to you later dhoti aapki taraf aapke liye aapko pahunchai jayegi kaise kabutar ke pair mein bandh ke matlab jaise bhi bandh ke matlab jaise bhi ho to jo bhi hai dhoti hai more than that what you are seeing on the screen right now these are very cool push up variations this is muddy muscles course 1 Dunned by Tech Sapate, you will get a playlist of seventeen videos, and you can access this at any time. All you have to do is download an app, and then you can access all these exercises and learn all this. This is course one, and what you can see on your screen right now, this is course number two. Kalari and Silambam inspired lati drills and workout. This is also available on the app. Download the app to get access to course one and course two. Course two is what you can see on the screen. This is a playlist of twelve videos you will get. You will get to learn all these cool moves one by one, and you will get to understand what is the martial art point of view of these exercises. And at the same time, how can you do it like an exercise, like a workout? So you'll get the goodness of both the martial art aspect and also the workout aspect. इतना ही homework काफी है आज के लिए. घर पे जाइए और अगले दिन करके आइए. Thank you.